We talked a little bit about the term monster yesterday, correct? Yes, I've heard that word quite a lot. Yes. Yeah, and you, you testified yesterday that you used that term to placate Amber, right? And I you, believe that you testified you, that it was the word that she clung to to describe what was in her mind, not yours. I, I wrote down what you said. Do you remember giving that testimony? Uh, the monster, more than anything, was uh, Ms. Hurd's way of referencing um, whether I was whether she perceived that I was on substances or taking substances. So the word monster became, it, it represented for her uh, the consumption of, of uh, alcohol or any other substances, um, whether it was actually happening or not, her perception. And so monster became her click word, right. if you will. But, but actually, the term monster to describe yourself came from you. Well, initially, Ms. Hurd, uh, I believe she started out with demons. Uh, she started out with a call, uh, saying that I had demons. And then when monster was put into uh, a conversation, which, again, uh, my, my, I have a... a particular way of using uh, words, vocabulary uh, in, my, uh, in, in my vernacular. So m monster uh, was something that, if, if, which she s stuck with, tried and true, I mean, she just stayed with that. Right, but, um, but you but, have but to you, accept it, came it from you. The unless term came you wanted you. to argue. The term came from you, didn't it? Uh, it's very probable. It's possible. It's probable that I that I might have used that 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 word certainly. Right, and and, and in 2012, in fact, um, Elton John was one of your friends who was trying to help you get sober. Correct. Yes, sir. And you 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 sent him a message in 2012 where you thanked him for his help and you said, "quote I would have been swallowed up by the monster were it not for you." That is a simple fact. Isn't yes. that true? Yes. Again, the monster referring to alcohol and, and substances. Correct. And, and you didn't send that message to Miss Heard. You sent that to Elton John. I would have been swallowed up by the monster were it not for you. Um, Correct? Elton, Elton uh, was, wait, wait, was a dear friend who... Um, has been uh, s s sober for I don't know, forty years, thirty years. So he was. Um, we'd had discussions, and he wanted to me to get uh, clean, sober. Um, so he actually, Elton actually sent uh, a, a, a fellow called Charlie Dunnett, who's, who worked with Elton for years and years. And Mr. Depp, I, I appreciate that. My only question was just to confirm that you had sent that message to Elton John, nothing else. Thank you. So I'll just, okay, I'll yeah. just stop talking. Um, thank you. I, I appreciate it. I want to be respectful of the court's problem, time and the, and the jury's time. Um, Sorry? I just said I want to be respectful of the court's time and the jury's time, and I, I trust that you do too. So um, well, I don't feel you, like I'm wasting anyone's time, sir. Could you pull up Exhibit 408, please? Mr. Depp, I'd like to, to turn your attention to the bottom text on this page. 